Your generation is the future of Kenya. Listen to me. You are the future of Kenya. I don't care what the circumstances or the economy says. God's calling is on each of you. You may or may not even know that. But the Lord spoke to my heart when He said, I want you to call these young men out because I'm missioning them to their generation. You love Jesus. In, in your heart, you want to do something for God. And you're not just Christians, you are called to be leaders. God is commissioning you today. I'm going to have my wife in just a minute blow the shofar. And when she begins to blow the shofar, I want you as a congregation to stretch your hands out towards these young men. And when that happens to you, my young friends, and we lay hands on you, the Lord is commissioning you. He's commissioning you to speak to your generation. And as you each seek the Lord with all your heart. And separate your life to God. Don't involve yourself as a lot of people in your generation. With drugs and liquor and all of that. Separate your life to God. Remember this day. Because this is the day God's commissioning you to be this is the day that God's putting his hand on you to be a leader. Amen. Value this time. Thank you, Jesus. Now you're this calling. How old are you? Fifteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. I saved when I was eighteen. If you had told me when I was eighteen I was going to go to Africa, you know what I would have said? What are you been smoking? What are you been drinking? I never dreamed I'd ever be in Africa. I slept in geography hardly knew where Africa was. So stretch your hands out towards these young people. Give them to the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God.
Amen.